hello guys and welcome back to my channel guys beauty over 50 lifestyles yes coming back with another video but first of all i gotta get my tea going so what kind of tea we drinking on this morning is black tea with a little bit of lemon and honey in there and i'm gonna put two packs of raw sugar in here so that's what i'm gonna be doing and i have my cantaloupe i cut up and this is gonna be my breakfast for this morning. So guys, I hope everybody's doing great out there, all you beautiful peoples. Gotta give an honor to my Father in Heaven because without Him, none of this is possible. So stay tuned and I will be back. We will be starting a new craft project. So stay tuned, guys. All right, guys, let's start crafting. So what you see in front of you guys um, I am making a fabric journal cover. So I don't want the cover to be so thick because I want the cover to move like fabric. So I made it out of a Yoplait box. You know, it's kind of thin because I'm gonna sew, also sew this on here. So that's what I wanted to show you guys what I made it out of. Now, I cut it down, I put it together, and I painted it white. And this is how it looks right now. So, I had wanted to paint that white. I think I gave it two, yeah, two coats of the white acrylic matte paint here, like so. And I let that dry. I left the inside like this because basically what I'm gonna be doing, do I have the other spine? Don't tell me I lost it. Oh, nope, here it go. My spine to go in the middle, right here, guys. So that's gonna go. I left um, two openings here on the side so that can fold, you know, like so. So yes, I kind of wanted it thin because this is gonna be, uh, well, all four of them, what I'm making is gonna be um, fabric journals. So. What I want to do, I probably do a little series on this. I'm making um, four journals for the four seasons of the year. And this journal right here is going to be the spring journal. I picked this material right here. I think this is gorgeous. It screams spring to me. And I am loving the home, the gathering. To live simple, you know, that's, I'm always promoting that, guys. God want us to go back to basics. Yes, he do. So, this particular uh, fabric here I got from my local dollar store. I'm just measuring it right now so I can cut this off and, um, Yeah, cut it off just a little bit, like, like so, so I can cut it about right here. I don't know if I'm in shot or not, guys, but let me cut that off, like so. And I'm gonna have this much material left, so I would have material to put over my spine. So now I'm gonna take this and cut this part right here in half. I'm gonna follow that line so I can get this as straight as I can. So, how are you guys doing again out there? I hope everybody is safe out there in YouTube land. I am doing great. I can't complain. It won't do no good to complain. <laughs> so, that is that. Yes, guys, I wanted to come in and do the four seasons because um, just something for, you know, when spring come in, you know, I can grab my spring journal. And when um, summer come in, fall, winter, I think that's great just to have those four. So I'm going to do one on the front and one part on the back. So, we're gonna do the front part first. What I'm gonna do is, uh, let me lay this down like so. So I'll be able to put the glue on there 
I am going to uh, glue this down with some uh, fabric hat. Let's over here and get this right here. It's been sitting, okay, yes, yeah, flowing. It's been sitting in my window, so. Yes, it's been pretty bad up here, guys. We um had an ice storm. I'm not gonna go on the sides too much because I am gonna be sewing around this. So I'm just going to put just enough, not a lot, because I'm gonna finger smush this down and everything like this. Finger smush it down real quick and then stick it on there. Yeah, guys, we um, I'm here in Michigan and we had a bad ice storm. It took out a lot of power. Yes, it did. Thank God my power didn't go out. But a lot of people's power did. Yes, they did. Yeah, I was telling my kids to invest in a generator next time that happened because sometimes the power goes out quite a bit up here. So... <clears throat> Make sure that's on the right side. And we're going to glue this down. Try to get it as even as possible. Okay. Where I can sew around that. Just turn it over. And take this little thingy right here. Straighten it out. I didn't want a whole lot of glue on here, so this is the way I'm doing this right now. Yeah. I didn't want that wrinkle in there, but that's okay. That's okay with me, because we're probably going to be putting a cover over it well something over it but yet yeah, now next I'm going to do the same thing I did on that side just glue it together and I am going to cut this down sew it together and we will be back to do the spine get the spine part together and then I can uh start getting my signatures ready to go in this particular book. So stay tuned, guys. All right, guys. I'm back and did a botch job on sewing my cover together. But that's all right. I don't have no more of this material, so I'm going to have to fix this. So we're going to have to save this. I am going to have to work something out here. <laughs> so, yeah. My sewing is got really crooked up here and everything, but that's okay. It is a spring junk journal. So, what I'm getting ready to do, we're going to decorate the cover. And um, if I have enough time, put the pockets on the inside and then... Uh, put my signatures together and sew them in. So get you something to drink guys, sit back and relax and let's go to work. All right, like I said, I botched this up. So what I did, I went through my thing and I found a spring picture, you know, nature, something to put here on the front for the, you know, the front like this before I even go around it. Uh, to do my lace and everything. So, hold on, guys. I forgot I had my TV on. Hold on, be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. I had to go turn the TV down a little bit. All right, so I found this picture here. I am going to, hmm, do I want to... Well, if I cover it up, I just cover it up. But for right now, I'm just going to corner 
this picture. I got this picture from out of the magazines. I do uh, have a subscription of magazines coming to my house. So when I get done with them, I just cut out the pictures that I, you know, images that I really like. So I want to glue this right here. So I'm gonna glue this on with some Fabri-Tac right here. Yeah, I gotta we, I gotta clean this and this up. I messed up. I don't know what I was thinking. Putting oh my goodness, I should put the material on the inside and then put the inside material on there and then sewed it together. Yeah, I kind of botched that one up. Pretty good. So. We're going to put this down with a little of this fabric tack here and um, stick it down about right here. Okay, let me open this up so I can uh, press down on that pretty good. Put that out there good. But yeah, guys, it's been bad up here. The weather has been bad. I just thank God that I I still have my power. Yes, I do. Okay, next, what we're going to do, I am going to take these stickers. I do, I love the flowers here, the little pathway and everything here. But what I'm going to do is take some stickers and I'm going to kind of make my own little flower garden in here. I hope I don't be all day figuring out these tickers again. Because I don't want to hold you guys up. I got too much to do. Oh, wow. That one came right off. So, I want to put this one right here. You know, kind of like blend in with the rest of the flowers. You guys will see when I get done. Yep. It's a method to my madness right now. <laughs> so let me get this off. Okay, that came off pretty easy. And I am going to kind of stick this. That should have been a white flower. I'm about getting ready to cover that one up. So, there we go. Put that on there like that to bring out the flowers and stuff. And next, I'm going to go around it with some lace here. I'm going to measure this lace. Yeah, little pieces of lace that I had that I need to. That's why I was wondering, should I cut my ends or not? So... I'm going to cut that one right there. And I'm going to tack that down like so. So, yep, let's get this tacked down. Yeah, I hope this cover come out looking okay. Because I really, I really do like the material, guys. Oh, Max is in everything tonight, as usual. <laughs> as usual all right perfect fit all right guys let's see can we find another smaller piece for that go here Hey guys, put down in the uh, uh, comment box where you guys at, and uh, are you? Do you live in a cold climate or not? Let me know. I would love to know. I've been living in Michigan, a cold climate forever. <laughs> you kind, you get, you never really get used to it. I put it that way. You kind of get used to it, but you don't. Because, hey, these ice storms, we haven't had an ice storm in a long time. And it's, it's pretty bad. All right, let's get this one this way here. Let me measure. I'm, I'm measuring. I'm not even 
um, I'm measuring these out. I'm just eyeballing it and hope I eyeball it right. <laughs> but yeah, I figure I put some lace around the picture. Find a uh, picture, you know, trees, spring, flowers, all that good stuff. And, uh, because I wasn't going to decorate the cover right now. But I'm like, uh, I got to do something about this. <laughs> I done messed this up. My sewing. And I don't, I must, you know, I my sewing is never that, uh, my goodness. So I think I'm gonna go around the uh, part around here with some lace also to cover up the job I done. <laughs> yeah, let's try to make this look good again. <laughs> yes, indeed. out there tearing up something. Let's push it down. Let me cut this off real quick. Snip that up like so. Or oh, unless he's playing with his toy. Let me go see what this cat is. Seem like at nighttime it just get energy. I don't know where you get all that energy from. Just be on the move. All right. I'm liking that. Now, what I want to do, I wanted to go in with this trim right here, guys, but it's white. And um, I don't know. I was thinking about if I do that, I could ink around there. But you can barely see that. So. I think I'm gonna do is just keep using this lace. Now I got this lace from uh, the dollar store. I like this lace. Every time I go in there, I grab two or three of these because I do use these a lot, generally. Yes, I do. All right, let's go ahead and cut that off. And you get a lot in here. Yes, you do for a buck and buck 25. Hey, that's not bad. All right, and then I'm going to put this up here and measure that. Let's get all of my lace measured. So guys, I think I'm going to put one here and measure that. If I cut them all now, I have them already ready. This is put this on this side also. Put this down. I'll be glad when this uh, ice melt up here <laughs> so I can get to go out. I gotta go out Saturday, anyways. It's my granddaughter's birthday. So they're giving her a big get together at one of these little kid places. So we're all gonna get dressed and go up there and enjoy ourselves with the children. So let me see, I wanna put that on there. Something like that. 
But basically, this is this is the route that I'm going, guys, to see can I save uh, this cover right here. So let's start gluing this on, uh, this lace on here. I'm gonna glue this one on with you guys, and then after this one, I'm gonna go off and glue the rest of these on and come back and we can uh, start doing the pockets on the inside of the journal. Cause I don't wanna uh, hold you guys up. I'm sitting here gluing. Uh, I know sometimes just watching it could be relaxing. Cause I watch journal videos myself and yeah, it's very relaxing to me. Yes it is. Now he's in here messing with stuff. <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. Yes, indeed. I hope you guys done went over there and uh, checked out my new channel. So, yeah. Um, let everybody know, you know, I am over there. I just put up another video over there about how to spot fake friends and families and lovers. So I did do a video on that. Yeah. Over there, you guys get to know me a little better, you know. Good way people get to know me. Um, I wanna do a live Q and A if you guys want me to do one of those over there, put it down in the comment box. Let me know. Let me see what the feedback gonna be. <laughs> yeah. Because I know I gotta get my, you know, I hope you guys like, share, and subscribe my videos so they can get back out there. Because I did change, um, the route I went, you know, making makeup videos. Uh, if I do make any more makeup videos, uh, they will probably be uh, putting on a little to nothing, to be honest with you. Because I kinda got out of that, um, the makeup. You know, since I gave my life back to Christ. And I've been, let me see. It's been a little over two years since I've, I gave my life back to Christ. And um, he's been dealing with me about the makeup, the trickery and everything like that. That goes with that. So that's why, guys, I took my channel a uh, different way, basically. So... That's why you see me doing other, other things on my channel than makeup videos. I still probably will do skincare videos, stuff like that, you know. But right now, hey, I'm just relaxing and uh, doing my journals. And, um, yeah, pretty much so. You know, I had to go a different way, so... Because I was going to put my other, the other, my other channel, I was going to do it on here, but no, I had to follow, like I said, I have to follow my father, and uh, he lets me know what to do. He needed, you know, he needed his channel on to his cell, basically. So, I agree with that. 100%. This is a channel that... You guys see me relaxing, doing me, you know, having fun, relaxing. And uh, the other channel is more, I'm more serious over there. All right, I'm going to put this lace right here. Right on top of that green. Oh, I should have went down a little more. That's okay, I can get a little piece from over here and piece that right there. Hmm, huh, worked out perfectly. I hope I'm in frame, guys. I said I was gonna go off and do this. I got to talking and 
and tearing on and gluing and, <laughs> and stuff like that. Oh yeah, that cat having a ball out there. I'm not out there seeing it. He is having a ball. All right, let me put this one down here like so. I might have to put a piece on this too, but that's okay. Yeah, I botched this up pretty good, so I'm like, oh, I gotta fix this. Gotta fix it, gotta fix it. I hope I'm doing it justice. <laughs> All right, guys. Oh, you stay down there. I think we're looking, we looking kind of good so far. We got the sewing all out the way. I think we're looking pretty good, guys. All right, what I probably want to do down here, I don't know. I probably want to put a little cluster, just a little cluster right here or right here, somewhere. I don't know yet. I probably save that for later on. Right now, I want to close this up, see how we're looking, and cut these edges off here, like so. Let's see, come here and cut these off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That looks a whole lot better. Yes, it do. All right. Let's cut this side. Pretty much. All right, let me cut this side over here. All right, there we go. All right, guys, what do you think? Tell me what you think. The little path, the trees, it's just, just, that picture to me just says beautiful, nice spring, beautiful day. The flowers are blooming. Everything is brand new again. Yes, I love it. All right. Now, next thing we're going to do, I want to do the inside. Oh, let me throw these away. I don't want to throw my bee away. Um, I want to take this vellum right here, the green vellum, and what I want to do is uh, mark this so I can um, make sure it's even because I don't want it to go on my, where my spine is going to go. It's right here. Now I'm going to try. I don't know why I'm trying it because last time I tried it and once it dried, it just peeled right off. That's the crazy thing about this, uh, this vellum here. But I don't know. I think I better do what I know and, and, and stay safe. <laughs> my little double-sided tape. Uh -uh. If you guys know what would stick on vellum, put it down in the comment box, guys, because I would love to know. Because you know, I did try it, and, and it came right back up after it dried. So... That's what happened to me. So I'm going to just use the double-sided tape. 
right now. And I'm gonna put these pockets down. Since I've been using a double-sided tape, I haven't had no problems with it at all. So if you guys do know, show me some love and help me out here. <laughs> all right, let's garnish these down. Where's my little... so far. I don't want to be on here for too long. I want to get my signatures in here also. But I'm just going to relax and, and, and just film. So I'm going to do it anyhow. So, yeah. I'm going to do it anyhow. You know who I've been missing on here and I haven't seen her. I hope she's okay. Miss D, I ain't, I haven't seen you lately, hon. Are you okay? Let me know. Put it down in the comment box. I haven't seen you in a while. I want to make sure you're doing okay. decorate the pockets too but not I'm not gonna decorate them tonight. Nope. Not tonight. Yep. So if you do happen to watch this video, Miss D, let me know you okay. Just a little concern. Make sure you are right. This here a journal card basically I'm gonna put a backing on here and make this a journal card so that can stay there all right guys tell me what you think I think it turned out did, did I save it or not let me know put it in the comment box yeah cuz it was toe up like I say a pretty little cluster somewhere I don't know if I should put a cluster down there or not I don't know let 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 me know guys what would you put on this cover or would you just leave it just like this all right now <clears throat> i'm gonna set this aside set that up here and show you my papers that i'm going to put together real quick i'm going to uh just show you what kind of papers i'm doing i'm doing a couple of greens uh those right there I'm gonna start folding these like so. And put them in my, uh, get them ready to go in my signature. Yeah. Go in my journal. <laughs> you know, you can say the crazy things when you're filming. And it don't happen until you start filming. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to get all of these together, guys. And um, all right, guys, my battery cut out then. But let's finish up. Last stretch. We're going to sew these signatures in. And then we're going to be done. So 
Let me get started. I threaded my needle with some, well, this is a black wax thread, but basically, uh, basically it's good for weaving hair in also. <laughs> yes, yeah, so basically, uh, I like to use that sometime. I, I do have all the other colors, but I do like to use that sometime. All right, we're gonna take that through. And when I do use it, I do double the, uh, double the thread up on this one. So, here we go. All right, I don't wanna pull it all the way through. I still, oh, I still got enough room to, that guys oh my goodness what is wrong with me tonight <laughs> all right let's get that back through here let's go back through this right here this hole right here which i know i'm gonna have to fuss with this one no i didn't I went right in thank the lord no more. Let's get this one in. I'm doing a three hole stitch right here. Real quick. I go from the uh, middle, top, then from the top all the way down to the bottom, bottom and we're going back in the middle here. Like so. There we go. You can always tighten you up. But... Alright, let's pull that needle out of there. Now let's tighten all this thread up. I like to have one, one wing on, I call them wings. Some thread on one side and, and the other thread on the other side. Make sure it's pretty tight. I do like the wet black wax thread. And it's very strong, I tell you that. You don't want your book falling apart. Get you some of this uh, wax thread, which we call it weaving thread. It ain't going nowhere. <laughs> so, yeah. All right. Let's uh, get tied a couple knots in there. Now, what I like to do, which I'm probably not going to do it tonight, is uh, put some beads and stuff on here. Scrub that down there so that give me a couple of strands I can bead. And what I'm thinking about doing, I found these shells, guys. I'm thinking about putting the shells on the end of those, right? Like something like that. I think that'll be very pretty. But in the meantime, I'm gonna need those to uh, I'm gonna glue the signature down. So I have that sewed to my uh, spine now. And this is basically what the pages look like. Some uh, decorative pages that I cut out of the, uh, well, got out of the uh, magazine. No, I'm not, Lord have mercy, got out of my paper pad. <laughs> Like this right here, the green on it. Just going through, showing you guys what the spread, the paper spread, looks like so far. And this is the middle of the journal. Um, I think I got about 15 pages in here, something like that. Not many, because I think it's, it's gonna give me. This is 10, 20, probably 30, 30-some page. I count them later on. But, um, oh, there you go. Just, uh, just some pieces in here where I can make some pockets and whatnot. 
I didn't want to fill it up because trying to fill up a journal, these are enough pages to fill up because once you get all of these filled up, they're going to, uh, it's gonna, you know, be pretty wide. So put that right in there like that. Now, once I glue that down like so, you know, I can always put a piece of material here, which I'm gonna do and put one on the other side to cover. Uh, I probably won't because there's really nothing wrong with this right here. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but this is how it looks, how it's gonna look. That's how that's gonna look on the inside. My string hanging down like so. And here we go. It's gonna be a lot of lace uh, coming out of there. I did cut that down to make that even. Cut that down. And basically this is how it looked. Oh, I wanted to make a pocket right here, but that's okay. But here we go, guys. I hope I saved the book. <laughs> Knowing me, I hope I saved it, guys. All right, though. But I'm going to get off of here, and I already held, held you guys a little bit too long. So, uh, like I always say, stay strong out there. Keep the faith. Never give up. And I will connect with you guys in my next video. Bye-bye, guys. Have a beautiful rest of your night.